Hi everyone. Um, today I'm coming to you from the desert in United Arab Emirates. It's amazing here. And I've done a lot of flying lately and so I've had to really take care of my body. So I wanted to offer some tips on some things you can do to help your body from flying or sitting at a desk for a long time or whatever's giving you aches and pains and stiffness. So you just sit in a comfortable position. You can sit in a chair on the floor, whatever feels best. Bring one hand down, bring the other arm over, and you're just gonna simply stretch over as far as you can without shortening the short side too much like that. So I'm really gonna think of length and then breathing into this long side that's stretching. So a nice big inhale and exhale. And every time I exhale, I feel my abdominals pull into my body. Inhale and exhale. Getting taller even on the short side. I'm really in a true side bend, meaning I'm not like this. That's what a lot of people tend to do. So keep your head and your tailbone lined up nicely. Uh, reach up really tall to come back to the center and then you'll do the other side. Reaching up. Inhale when you're there. Exhale, abdominals lifting. Inhale, neck and shoulders relaxed. Exhale, feeling your abdominals draw into your body. One more inhale and exhale. And exhale, lifting up. Okay, you do that for a few more sets just to really get the, that length in your waistline. Uh, the second thing you can do is take your hands behind your head, open your elbows as if someone's pulling them back behind you, and you're going to round just your upper back a little bit. It's not pulling your neck down like that. You're just softening your chest and rounding your upper back. Very small. And then doing the opposite, lift your abdominals, your low abs, and then lift your chest to really open through that upper back. Do that again. You're going to round the upper back only, just your upper back, and lift. You're breathing as you go. One more time. Round just the upper back, pulling the abdominals, the belly button in when I'm rounding, continuing to pull them in as I open to the chest. Take that into a small side bend, just like you did on the first exercise. Drop your head into that rounded position. Come over to the other side and coming back. So you're just creating a circle here, breathing as you go, keeping the movement as smooth as possible. And really focusing on that rib cage mobilizing will really help you feel better. And then go the other way. The two most important things to remember during all exercises and movements and stretches, and this is included is to continue to breathe, always breathing. Doesn't really matter when you inhale or exhale, just keep going with your breath. And the second thing is to always have support in your abdominal walls. It doesn't mean you're clenching, but you're pulling up. You have that energy. I hope that helps you feel better, and let me know if you have any questions or comments, and thanks for joining me.